This is ANN News Brief. Good afternoon. I'm Lucy Adeyemi. Fifteen migrants have died in a boat off the Libyan coast after spending 12 days at sea without food or water. An Egyptian survivor said on Tuesday 25 migrants were in the boat as they set off from the western Libyan town of Sabrata before it capsized off the coast due to bad weather. Ten others were injured and brought to the Red Crescent Relief Service and Hospitals. They came ashore in Misrata some 270 kilometers east of their departure point. Libya's western coast is a departure point for mainly sub-Saharan African migrants fleeing wars and poverty and hoping for new lives in Europe. The move to have an East African community ESC international passport has hit a slag in Uganda after members of parliament, MPS, blocked it over its legality and the cost to users. ESC leaders agreed in 2016 to upgrade the ESC passport from a regional to an international document with Kenya and Tanzania launching it last year. Uganda, Rwanda, Burundi and South Sudan were given until January 2019. Uganda lodged a passport that cost about $70 on Tuesday. The MPs queried the loyalty of some states of the community and the laws under which the e-passport was issued. We'll be back after this message. If you know it, go internet. Because you the use of Palasa, hey. your phone no the answer. See me, see Wahala. Ah, my brother, go get smart for the air. Hey. Drop that Palasa phone. Phone when no go for your honey. Drop hey. that Palasa phone. Phone when no fix the chaffy. Drop that Palasa phone. Hey. No be correct for the air. Drop hey. that Palasa phone. Hey. Upgrade to a smartphone today and get double data for six months on any MTN data bundle you buy. Simply purchase a smartphone from any store anywhere in Nigeria or bring your current smartphone from any network. Insert your MTN SIM card to start enjoying your double data bonus. Offer is open to all new and existing MTN subscribers. Join the largest smartphone movement today. Make it up for your hand. South African national rugby team player Tendai Mutawarira, nicknamed the Beast, has launched a foundation aimed at introducing the game to rural areas in Zimbabwe, his home country. The Get Involved Foundation also seeks to foster social cohesion and promote education across Africa. Explaining his motivation, Mutawarira says he represents the whole continent and wants to inspire all youth in Africa. Mutawarira plays for the Durban-based side, the Sharks, and the national team. He says he wants to use his foundation launched in London on Sunday to give African children a better chance in life through sports. Mutawarira has played for the Springboks for the last 11 years and amazed more than 11 caps, a rare feat in the game. That's the NN News Brave. Join us again at 5 for our full newscast. For details on these and other stories, visit our website, nnafrica.net. Also join the conversation on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter at NN Africa TV. I am Lucy Adeyemi.